Well, welcome back. Let's get into today's trending stories. It is time for Hot, Hot topics. topics. Yes. All right. Well, it doesn't take seven rings to make Ariana Grande happy. Just one. Yeah. The singer announced her engagement to Dalton Gomez on social media, posting a picture of the ring with the caption, forever and then some. I love that. Yeah. Ring. Her ring is very unique. It's uh, like an oval-shaped diamond and a pearl. I saw that. Next to it. So I'm looking. I'm yeah. interested to in learning more about the significance uh, there. Grande not only celebrating her engagement, starting today, fans can check out a behind behind the scenes movie on her Sweetener World Tour entitled, um, Excuse Me, I Love You, <laughs> which is streaming now on Netflix. So, you know, no more tears left to cry <laughs> as she heads into the new year. This is perfect because um, she had to actually cancel the tour, of That's course, right. because of coronavirus. And I remember seeing on social media, she was devastated that she had to do that, of course. But this is a great way for fans to kind of be in the moment with her. Lots of concert footage, some behind the scenes uh, of just Ariana being Ariana. So yes. I'm sure fans are going to eat this up. Including my daughter, I'm sure. She loves Ariana right yes. now, so <laughs> I guess we're going to be watching this later on. Uh, Google is unveiling the top five GIFs uh -huh. of 2020. Now, I say GIFs. I know some people say GIFs. There's controversy out there. We did a quick poll around the newsroom. Uh, GIFs, GIFs won the cake, so we're <laughs> saying GIFs. Uh, Google says more people than ever before created GIFs on its Tinder platform, and if you couldn't find the words, you could probably find a short animated clip known as a GIF to express yourself every Everything from remembering a legend like Kobe Bryant to the oddity of Tiger King to birthdays in quarantine to the most 2020 experience of all, panic buying toilet paper. <laughs> so here are the top five. Let's check it out. Number one, toilet paper panic. Just said it. Number two, Tiger King. Number three, Kobe, of course, remembering Kobe. And then uh, number four, Mean Girls. And number five, quarantine birthday. Yeah, Mean Girls is one that will never go away, especially never now away. because they did that Christmas routine. Yes. I um, mean, also the Wednesday. You know, on pink we wear Wednesday. On every of course. Wednesday we wear pink. So. Of course. Um, yeah. And now that it's on yeah. Broadway, it's a show on Broadway, I think it's even more popular. That's right. right. Bringing it back. That's right. Yeah. Now, as we continue to celebrate the holidays from a distance, Zoom will once again lift the limits on calls for your family, which is perfect. Yes. Uh, for several days throughout the rest of December, covering Christmas and New Year's, Zoom will extend this, the time limit. Normally, if you want to extend meetings with three or more people on Zoom's free service, you would have to go through the hassle of starting another meeting and have everyone join that. Uh, so of course, make sure you get a picture of your family. Oh, yeah. When you're doing the family Zoom, we had this whole debacle when we did one. Here's my there family from Thanksgiving. Had to yell at people to tell yeah. them to stop what they're doing, gather up their kids, everybody take a picture. I had to do it like three times, but <laughs> here it is right here. Um, and then the craziest part about Zoom, make sure, of course, your computer is charged up. We were closing out the meeting. Raymond was like in prayer. The computer shuts off uh -uh. because my computer died. We were on Zoom for two hours. <laughs> that is like one of the most 2020 things I've ever heard. Just to cut make out. Make <laughs> sure you have plenty of power in your devices and make sure you get a picture of everyone. That is my kind of Zoom takeaway. I love that. That's a great <laughs> Zoom takeaway. It's great tips to yes. your holiday Zoom meeting that I'm sure you're going to have with your oh, family yes. this year. Right. Oh my gosh, here's a scary moment for Santa Claus. Check this out. Firefighters in Sacramento released this video of them making a daring rescue of a high-flying Santa Claus. A man took off in a hyperlight powered parachute when it lost power and then it became suspended in power lines. Now power nice. was shut off to about 200 customers in the area to allow firefighters to bring Santa Claus down to safety. And fire officials say the man was trying to do something nice for the kids in the community. So thankfully no one was injured. That's right, be careful Santa. Oh man, be careful Santa. Not this week. Not <laughs> Come on, not this week. Let's do it. Uh, we're going to keep talking hot topics. We'll be right back with more Good Day in WA. I'm glad he's okay. I am too. <laughs>